Lucas looking for that over half left. Now we're going to see what this kid's made of. Main event of the evening. It's our tail of the tape. Ryan Garcia, 22 years old. He's on a rocket ship to superstardom if he wins tonight. All right, gentlemen, went over the rules earlier in the dressing room. Obey my commands. Protect yourselves at all times. Understood? Touch them up. Best of luck to both of you. Through these, through these, through the doubt, through the darkness of fans. His last two fights have gone a total of 178 seconds. It's per round. It's a pretty useful weapon for him in most of his fights. Ryan Garcia coming out a little bit aggressive. Coming in. I love, I love what I'm seeing. I love this start by, by the young Ryan is the key for Campbell. Mm -hmm. Campbell's been on this stage before. He knows how to handle the pressure, the bright lights, the international audience, so to speak. Sharp. And right now, Campbell is, is looking to time that sharp. Oh, a straight right hand. That was a little trip up of the feet, and you're going to see a lot more of that. Fighting southpaws because he thinks there's more ways to knock them up. Because he has a Campbell at bay for a while. We saw a Euro step there from Garcia. Campbell really special. That that educated jab is experienced, of course, with the body work. Ooh, a left hook from Campbell. Kind of got a smile from King Rai. Campbell, so, Garcia 4-0 with four knockouts. But Chris, we don't know if he's good late. To secure those early knockouts, but you don't know how your fighter's going to fare. When he gets taken, it would work better against southpaws. You buy that, Sergio? Especially a young fighter says that he prefers fighting southpaws. But look at Garcia heating up in the corner. Campbell punches against southpaws. Excuse me, Campbell knows, Campbell knows he's to deal with some of those floors. You see Campbell up on his toes. Garcia much more flat foot. It seems like he wants to... Oh, left hand sends the kid down! And that's what he was setting him up for. Luke was looking for that overhand left. See what this kid's made of. An absolute stunner. And look at the face. Not up. moving away from those shots. And Luke staying cool. I love this. The discipline. He knows he has the younger fighter hurt. Going through Ryan Garcia's My stunning goodness. start here to the second round. Campbell just missed with that overhand left. Make a mistake. Worst way. Are you all right? Yes, yes I'm fine. I'm fine. You okay? We yeah, spoke about earlier about, you know, Mike back Garcia back. getting up and fighting him off. Has Garcia been over He's height? taking rid of one-punch knockout Luke Campbell. He's too tough. That's what happens when those first-round knockouts come. They start getting good to you and think... This is when he can attack when he's on the ropes, and that's what he does. But they got that killer instinct. I love what Garcia's doing, backing up Campbell. This crowd still buzzing. Every ticket sold. 6,000 fans here, and they're all cheering for the Mexican-American. So far, I love the way Ryan We never know how we're going to react as fighters. And he passed the test, and he's still getting it. Who says he could throw his left hook a million times and never get tired. Now Garcia with the punches. Getting, getting aggressive. He's a flat-footed fighter, but he has such fat pants. This is when he can tee off, and that's what he does. And now he won this third round with the aggression coming from the world now. Hope you're enjoying this on the event. Ryan Garcia, who was... You know, one of the questions, I'm pretty mild. Said he felt a mild cold for five or six days. He's back at full training. This fight is supposed to take place at the beginning of the day of 2021. Thanks to everyone joining us. Past, I would feel stronger and rejuvenated. Again to the body with the left hand goes Luke. Campbell's best weapon is his body punch. Oh, right hand, and that affected Luke. And now he's starting to sit right the head now. He sees that the left another weapon against the left hander. You can just see he needs to experience this for the first time. I did extremely well. Got up, survived the rounds, doing good work for most of this. 
Beautiful move right there by Campbell. Pivoting away from that big punch. It wasn't a flash knockdown. He got rocked. He got up and fought back harder. Garcia's throwing some big shots. I think they're both looking confident. Ryan Garcia just weak. Ooh, and he got caught coming. Swing that hook wide. It's nice and short. That's going to catch the faster fire. Beat, beat it to the punch with timing. The possibilities are endless with a win here for Ryan Garcia. As for Luke Campbell, a win for him. Garcia, two things that you touched on. He's never been much on head movement, never been much on because he has so, so fast hands. His hands are so fast. Power punches through round four. 42 landed for him. Always going to land more power shots. Just as I say that. Power shots right in line with Garcia's numbers under Eddie Reynoso. 45. Really haven't seen Garcia big, heavy flurry in a while. A good, good. To get that power, that speed. Oh, and there's a nice little flurry for Campbell. After that knockdown. Seems like Garcia is winning these rounds. Same short right hook again. So this is a good round. Oh, he's good round. With the left hook right at the bell, and Campbell was ready to go down. That's Garcia's best punch. That it's a snappy left hook. The ropes may have kept him up. Maybe he hurt. Now it's time for Campbell to show Texas, and this has become an old. He's got Campbell a little bit weakened here. He's letting his hands. Campbell's corner told him, "Get your composure." Oh, basically code for survive at this point starting around. Garcia, oh, yeah. they're pretty boys with a mean when they have their opponents hurt. And in between that flurry, like all of them basically put their hands up, telling Ryan Garcia to relax. Don't get too aggressive. Committing to those jabs. Good cross, all right. This This has not been the type of fight many people expected it to be, but it has what does Campbell need to do to collect himself? Straight right hand. There's that check. Garcia tried to time Campbell coming in with that left hook. And this is not where Campbell wants to be. Oh, and he got a straight. Luke Campbell knocked Ryan Garcia down. Garcia, though, has come back like a true champ so far. Look, I think Garcia has been in control and won. Ever said he recovered nicely. Landed a lot of big shots. He's been very successful the first half of this fight. And that resilience, Chris, comes from, from instinct. I see. So in this fight, but Campbell's showing all his boxing skills. He stayed in there brilliantly after being hot. Do you really think that Luke Campbell needs to... Reynoso saying to Ryan Garcia, you're young. Body shot. And he goes down. knocked out Oscar De La Hoya with a vicious body shot. That body shot looked just as pretty.